All right, guys, hope you're doing well. This is Lewis Rowlands here, and I'm a nutritional balancing practitioner. And in this video, I want to talk about something that I don't think gets enough, enough attention. And really, it's probably a secret to healing for guys, especially. Um, and that is basically losing fluids, sexual fluids, semen, ejaculation. Um, so I'm just going to be totally brutal, brutally honest, because I think it's what it needs. Um, you will not heal if you do not stop ejaculating. Um, and that's basically, um, the be all and end all of it. Um, you need to stop ejaculating right now because, you know, you will feel your best when you're not ejaculating. Because that's when you've got high zinc, you've got high testosterone, it makes you feel super strong, it makes your brain feel clear, you know, that feeling that everyone's wanting to achieve, excuse me, that feeling that everyone's wanting to achieve, that strength, that masculine drive, that forward momentum, you know, that that fantasy that's probably in your head, you're not, you, you know, sometimes you might feel it if you've taken drugs in the past or whatever, just strength and vitality you will not get that feeling if you ejaculate often now i'm not saying don't ever do it but what i'm saying is don't like think about it all the time you know maybe um if in my opinion if if you're single and not in a relationship just try and stop it altogether and and see it as like a philosopher a philosopher's stone of healing you know everyone's wanting that sort of magic pearl you know and uh, if anyone could if i could turn around to anyone any guy and, and 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 they say to me what's the secret what's the thing that's really gonna get me to the levels that i want to get to that would be it so um i know it's tough because society tell tells us that it's fine to do and you know um i know that guys do it often um sometimes every day sometimes twice a day um but you, you've got to stop it even when you're doing the full program I mean, even when you're doing the program and you're doing everything correctly if you're doing it maybe you know um more than once a week you're gonna struggle and in my opinion once a week's enough and i think you shouldn't even be looking at it from that perspective oh how many how many times can i do it a month don't even think about it just be like this is the secret ingredient to me feeling great you know and um obviously if if you stop doing it um in a couple of weeks or three weeks you're not just going to feel back to normal and great all of a sudden but it's the real linchpin that you've got to keep on doing consistently and you will heal way 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 quicker um and feel much better for people in relationships i know it's a tough pill to swallow but you've got to be in a position where you're just not ejaculating um now um you know i appreciate that this is much more challenging for people in relationships because that sexual energy is there more often um but what i will say is that um you know some people are with partners that um are addicted to sex that's in my opinion a red flag and that needs to be addressed um some women and men um um are addicted to like sexual fluid so they've got like sexual fluid craving um where they get sort of a, a buzz or a kick out of um fluid so they want you to have sex more that again in my opinion is a giant red flag that needs to be looked at um but really the best way to look at it in a relationship is you know when it you know when when you do want to ejaculate and it should be maybe once a month once every two months um then you know at least make sure that when you do do it it's um you know, it's not just something that you do quickly in the morning or you do quickly at night. You could plan it a little bit, you know, make sure that you've, you know, done something nice for the evening. Um, you know, you just don't, it's just not something that you're just going to throw away because it's just less life energy. It's incredible, incredibly healing 
and uh, it gives you so much strength and power that you just don't want to be throwing it away, like, without any thought, you know, so that's basically what I want to say about that. I could talk, <laughs> I could talk further, <laughs> um, it's probably not the best, uh, the best, the, the, the best thing for me to talk about, um, you know, that sort of stuff on you, <laughs> on, on YouTube, um, but in general, um, as a guy, um, I know that uh, if you, if a woman climaxes, then um, you know it's sort of less important for you to to climax. I know guys are quite selfish, and uh, you know I know a lot of women that realise that guys are quite selfish, and that guys will just uh, you know orgasm really quick. Um, but if you want a tip from me, <laughs> if you're in a position where you don't want to ejaculate, you just make sure that your partner has climaxed, <laughs> and then it's much more easier you know, to, um, yeah, to not ejaculate. So that's this video. Um, sorry, I've been not doing regular videos recently. I've just been, uh, yeah, relaxing, really enjoying the sun, enjoying the weather, getting some good vitamin D. And um, yeah, I actually feel like I have come up with a formula for um, the human psyche where you keep your emotions always at a high level which is something I've been delving into recently so I think that was a key that should be added onto the program at some point so I'll probably talk about that more in other videos down the line alright so yeah thanks for watching and um, catch you soon